Hey YouTube, this is Southern Prepper One. I want to talk about organizing all of your prepping, your survival supplies, homesteading supplies, or just in general, getting organized. Um, I've seen a lot of people uh, buy a lot of stuff and they're not organized, and I've seen a lot of people uh, have things destroyed because they didn't bucketize it quick enough, or uh, rats and mice get into it, or they didn't store it in the proper location. So try to protect your investment and these are investments that your your supplies you buy for the future are, are investments so protect them I want to show you how I'm protecting them and give you some good advice what to do I have been using in the last few weeks uh, maybe a month some online auction sites um, they're local and I've been picking up some file cabinets with the whole push to digital uh, files are becoming obsolete um, so recently I purchased some of these right here and they are the best thing for getting organized um, I haven't wrote on all of them yet because I'm still trying to get about six seven eight more um, I'm redoing the whole shop I'm trying to get more organized uh, so I can get more work done so I have a, a better place to work on uh, wood projects but a lot of them I'm getting are very very affordable I'm paying anywhere from five six dollars up to ten to twelve dollars um, I think these were 750 each uh, which is very affordable they're like brand new they're in mint condition some of them this one over here wasn't as good I got this from an estate auction so instead of having uh, auctions at people's estates they're just putting them online now so look around your area um, I, I think I paid seven or eight dollars for this it's in perfect shape other than a little bit of rust on the handles um, a lot of these are available I have shelves in here awesome for storage and then you have lateral file cabinets of all different sizes so look around uh, see if you can find some of these they beat any other type of storage um, th this type right here is totally mouse proof I mean there's no way a mouse can get in even on the bottom uh, so it protects your stuff. I like it also because it less clutter. So if you are doing a messy project and you're getting a lot of dust and dirt everywhere, you're not getting it on certain things. Um, also, it's great for fire protection. It's if you get a small fire going, you can easily put it out. Uh, it doesn't grow into a huge fire because you have all these uh, boxes or or things that are very flammable. So it's also good for to protect it. Now the lateral ones. Pull out this way. Um, I like them both. They both serve great purposes. Um, so really, I'm buying them right now. Whatever I can get, I, I'm hoping to get a bunch more of these because they just seem to be the perfect fit for me. Also, I'm using these for storage. I've been buying these over the years, and I, I love them because I can see what's in there. I got them labeled: zip ties, whistles, survival items, light bulbs. Uh, it's just organizing my stuff and it helps my wife because she gets very frustrated um, when she can't find something because I have it in here but I just she can't find it now this is giving her the ability to come in here because uh, she doesn't come in here a lot but when she needs something uh, she can just come look really quick uh, and find the the right uh, drawer and get it out so look at your auction site online typically you will pay about 15% auction commission on your item and some places you have to pay sales tax so remember that that will add a little bit of money to it um, but I think these file cabinets will be available in your area uh, very affordable look some of them will come with locks um, so that is just a huge blessing I have a few I want to replace the locks so I'm gonna go to my local locksmith and take these out and see what he can do for me or maybe even look at Amazon after I figure out what I need if hypothetically I bought this one as you can clearly see it was locked it took me literally one minute with the cordless drill and a large drill bit I drilled that out and that thing popped out they show videos on YouTube where they're very easy to pick these um, so look at that maybe you want to pick it if not just drill it this will pop out and away you go be very careful though that you don't have children or someone not thinking and push these in when you don't have a key 
I, I believe they will lock without the key. I'm not 100% sure, but just make sure you don't do that. So think about protecting uh, your survival supplies, your homesteading supplies. There's a lot of other cabinets out there you can get. These are some lower ones. I actually got those for free from a business. I got those for free. Uh, a guy moving, didn't need them. Uh, all these big ones I got for free from a business. Um, so look around. File cabinets are a dying breed. It's all going digital. So get organized. It will help you get to your equipment quicker and faster and make it last. Thanks for watching.